Okay, for this lesson we're going to look at what are some of the typical errors that people will make up to this point. The first error is when they do 3 times 2n, they give 6n, they write down minus 6 at the end. They forget that 3 has to go times that, and 3 has to go times that. Okay, so that's the error right there. Error. You can help yourself by not making that error in two ways. Remember that brackets mean both. And also put in the little arrows or the little rainbow like I do every time. The next error comes when they take three to the other side. They would then do something like this. They would write it out as 5n equals 8 plus 3. What they forgot to do was change the sign of the plus 3. Error. Okay, you've got to remember if you're changing sides, change the sign. The next error, people will say 4p plus 2p is 6p squared. Error. You're not multiplying p times p. So the correct answer would be 6p, not 6p squared. Next error, 5r take away r. Okay, a lot of people will take the r, take away the r, and they'll say the answer is just 5, because the two r's have canceled. Okay, but in fact, this is actually 1r. So that's an error there. What you end up with is 5 r take away 1 r and you get 4 r as your correct answer. Okay, um, so if there's no number in front assume it to be a 1. The next error, 3 w take away 3 w, I've seen students leave it with a w. They say 3 minus 3 is 0 so I don't have to put it down but you'll leave it as a w. Error, because you know that w is the same as 1 w. So 3 take away 3 is 1? Doesn't make sense. Okay, so the correct answer is 3w take away 3w is equal to 0, not w. And the last uh, typical error made, people will do 12p plus 36, and they'll do the 4 into the 12, and they'll say the answer is 3p plus 36. Okay? error right there. What they forgot to do was put the little arrows in and remind yourself that a bar just like a bracket means the word both. So both of these guys are divided by 4. 4 into 12 peanuts is 3 peanuts. 4 into plus 36 should be plus 9. So the correct answer should be 3p plus 9. Okay? So if you can read back and look at those six typical errors, they cause a lot of problems in the questions coming up. Yes, and the correct answer for this one will actually be 6n minus 3 times 6, which is 18.